What is going on guys? It's a wanted turtle and today we're doing some more magic openings uh, We're going to continue all three of our boxes and today we're doing more Ravnica Allegiance uh, War of the Spark is right around the corner. I hope everyone's excited And if you are definitely hit that like button down below just to support the channel uh, kind of helps the channel grow and reach new viewers um, So Ravnica Allegiance uh, we're still in this box. We still haven't pulled a hydrate crisis So that's definitely what we're crossing our fingers for uh, Definitely the best mythic in the in the set, and uh, yeah, we still have a lot of shocklands to pull. So far, we have none from this box. So, hopefully, we can pull a good number of them in this opening. Let's get into it. All right, Ravnica Allegiance, very good set. Although I feel like the packs, I, I mean, it's just blue for some reason. This light blue uh, looks kind of boring, even though I like blue. <laughs> but I'm not sure what it is. But the pack arts are a little dull to me. But definitely what's important is the cards themselves and uh, tons of really good strong cards in this set. So let's go through some of the commons, then we'll pick up the pace. We got Prying Eyes, Steel Wheel Acrobat. Yeah, the, the Rakdos stuff is very, uh, very strange. Twilight Panther, Sage's Row Savant, Undercity Entrance, em Embrace, uh, Gift of Strength, Battle Juggler, Blade Juggler, very good card. A Goblin Gathering, a Summary Judgment, Clamor Shaman. We have one of the dual cards, Dispose and Deploy. These were already in the uncommons. Another one, Collision and Colossus is pretty good. Ooh, I did see a foil back there. And then Kaya's Wrath, very nice. Solid pull. Ooh, here's a foil rare and precognitive perception. I don't think this one's very good. Draw three cards. Addendum, if you cast a spell during your main phase, instead scry three, then draw three. For five. That is very expensive. That's a nope. Definitely the foil ray that you're looking for is a shock land. Um, those ones always going to be a hot item. Even probably stand the test of time better than like the some of the biggest biggest rares like smothering tithe. Oh, I forgot we wanted to go through the commons, but we'll do that next one. We got a Gaia Engineer, Sphinx of the Guild Pack, Flames of the Raised Boar, and then Ethereal Absolution. There's Kaya. Kaya and uh, Tisa in that pack. Right, let's see if we're seeing you already. We got a res Persistent Petitioners. Pretty good card. Rakdos, a applied biomancy, root snare, Azorius locket, syndicate messenger, clear the mind, Oop. Raptor demon, Orzov racketeer, and then biogenic upgrade, knight of last breath, and then oh my gosh. Wow, we pulled the best card in the set. Here's the Hydroid Crisis. This card is absolutely insane. So green, blue, and then X. So as always, for these Hydras, which are almost always terrible, they get X power, X strength. Uh, however, or that many plus one plus ones. But however, whatever half of X is rounded down, you also gain that much life and draw that many cards. This card is so insane. Imagine if you are a control deck and then boom, you play this thing. It's huge um, and you heal up because you're control and then you also get your all that many cards. So strong. Uh, single handly would basically turn games around. We got a Dovin's Acuity as well. Whew. So we still don't have any shock lands. How we just pulled the best card in the set. So this has been, this box just went so it went from like honestly it went from pretty good to absolutely insane. Whew. Alright, let's keep it going. We got this card is so funny. Screaming Shield. A galloping Lizrog. This is another strange one. A wilderness reclamation. This card's actually this card is actually insane. Uh, for four mana, so it's kind of expensive, but not terrible. At the beginning of, of your end step, untap all lands you control. Very strong card. And then we got Zygenet Utopian Speaker. Uh, I can't remember if this card is good. Uh, 
Okay. What a opening, guys. Definitely hit that like button down below. We just pulled a Hydroid Crasis. All right, let's see. We got a Sphinx of the new, new Prov. Swirling Torrent. Resolve Watch, Resolute Watchdog. <laughs> and then Priest of Unforgotten Gods. I think I have um, a foil version of that. Ooh, another foil common. Okay, we have a Skate Wing Spy, Hacrobat. Ooh, there we go, Terramander. So this card's absolutely insane. Forget about the Adapt. Eight mana, that's way too high. Just a 1-1 one, one Flyer for one mana. Very insane. Ooh, yes, here we go. Our first Shockland. Surprise is our first one. Um, but then the, I don't think it's from the set, but then the something Curiosity, basically, you throw that down on turn one, and then next turn you just equip it with the enchantment. Basically, if you do damage, you draw a card. Um, the next turn for only another man, and then you can just that becomes your draw engine. It's very hard to stop on like turn two. All right, clear the stage. A Rectos Firewheeler, Fireblade Artist. That is insane art. The guy is absolutely psycho. And then a Pestilent Spirit. All right, about halfway done with the box. Very strong opening. We got a Godless Shrine. Not the... Uh, one of the better shock lands. Not the best. But we did get the best mythic card in that Hydra. All right, we got a Clan Crusher. Light up the stage. It's a very useful card. Basically, as long as you did... Um, uh, exile types of cards again until the end of your turn. You may play those cards. Very nice. And as long as you, uh, so the spectacle, you may cast this spell for just one. Um, if your opponent, if you've done damage. All right, cult guild mage. Then biomancer's familiar. Don't think that card's anything special. All right, we got a Windstorm Drake, Forbidding Spirit, Orzhov Enforcer, and then a Gruel Spellbreaker. Um, it was just like a solid card, nothing crazy. It has Riot, has Trample, and as long as you're, it's your turn, he has Hexproof, which uh, I guess like if there's a turn to have Hexproof Spy on your opponent's turn, but it's just a very solid card, nothing crazy good, but definitely strong. All right, we have three packs left, including this one. Engage, Enrage, Ceratok, um, Sturgeon of Obligation, Zora Skyguard, and then one of the dual cards, Warrant and Warden. Those cards are almost always terrible, which makes sense. Like it's essentially two and one, so the cards, the both effects, have to can't be that strong. So I feel like that's just a hard, hard card to pull off. So if they all stink, I, I wouldn't blame wizards. You know, it's just, it's hard to get that one. Like the game, the meta is hard enough to balance as it is, let alone the those kind of cards. Xerti Goblin, Gatebreaker Ram, and then Awaken the Erstwhile. All right, on to our last pack. We got this clown guy. <laughs> Look, he looks like he's from Rakdos. All right. How are we going to wrap up this insane opening? Can't believe we pulled that Hydroid Crisis. Alright, let's see. We got Dispose and Deploy. A Vindictive Vampire. Sentinel's Mark. And then for the last pack, we have. Oh, this card is terrible. 
All right, gain control of X target creatures and planeswalker, but it costs four and then two X. Jeez, so expensive. So there you guys have it. Pretty good, or no, very strong opening. We got the Hydroid Crisis. Let me move it here in case my face cam is blocking that. We don't need to talk about the foil rares, nothing special, but we got Godless Trying, Kai's Wrath, and the Hydroid Crisis, which is the biggest hit in the set. Very happy with this opening. Um, as always, if you did enjoy the content, please hit that like button down below just to help this community continue to grow. Uh, subscribe if you're new to the channel. We do do Pokemon videos every day, uh, as well as we mix in Magic the Gathering, of course, as well as Yu-Gi-Oh! as well. So if you're a fan of any of those games, definitely subscribe to the channel. Uh, you'll enjoy your stay. Um, with all that being said, guys, I'm Moana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.